Hey, Amelia, have you ever watched any Indian movies? Hi, Ryan. Yes, I've seen a few. They're quite different from what I'm used to, but really interesting. How about you? I just watched my first one last weekend. The music and dance sequences were amazing. Right? The songs are so catchy. I find myself humming them sometimes. Me too. And the colors. Everything is so vibrant. Absolutely. It's like a celebration in every scene. Did you have a favorite part? I love the storytelling. It was a mix of drama, comedy, and romance all in one. That's what I like about Indian cinema. They blend genres so well. What movie did you watch? It was called Dilwale Dulhania Le Jayeng. It's apparently a classic. Oh, that's a great one. A true love story. I watched Three Idiots. It was inspiring and funny. I've heard about that. It's on my list now. Do you watch them with subtitles? Yes, I do. It helps understand the nuances of the dialogue. Same here. I'm trying to pick up a few Hindi phrases, too. That's a good idea. It makes the experience more immersive. Definitely. By the way, did you notice how long Indian movies are? Yes, they do tend to be quite lengthy, but I think it allows for more detailed storytelling. True. There's a nice break in the middle, too, which is interesting. The intermission. It's a good time to discuss the movie if you're watching with others. Exactly. Speaking of which, have you tried any Indian food recently? Yes, I had some delicious biryani the other day. It complemented the movie experience. I love biryani. I tried making samosas at home. Turned out pretty good. That sounds fun. Cooking Indian food is an art. I'm still learning. Me too. There's so much variety. Anyway, have you been to any Indian festivals? Not yet, but I'd love to experience Holi. The Festival of Colors looks so joyous. It does. I want to participate in Diwali, too. The Festival of Lights must be beautiful. Agreed. It's fascinating how these festivals are depicted in movies as well. Yes, it gives a glimpse into the culture and traditions. Absolutely. Speaking of culture, I've been reading about traditional Indian clothing. It's so elegant. I agree. The saris and kurtas have such intricate designs. I even bought a kurta recently. It's very comfortable. Nice. I've been thinking of getting one too. It seems perfect for the summer. Definitely. Hey, are you planning to watch any more Indian movies soon? Yes. I want to watch Bahubali. I've heard it's an epic. It is. The visuals are stunning. You'll love it. Can't wait. Maybe we can watch it together? That would be fun. Let's plan a movie night. Great idea. I'll bring the samosas this time. And I'll try making chai. It's a deal. Perfect. I'm looking forward to it. Well, I've got to go now, but let's chat soon about the plans. Sure thing. I'll text you. Take care, Ryan. You too, Amelia. Bye. Practice session. Let's practice together. I'll go first. Hey, Amelia, have you ever watched any Indian movies? I just watched my first one last weekend. The music and dance sequences were amazing. Me too. And the colors. Everything is so vibrant. I love the storytelling. It was a mix of drama, comedy, and romance all in one.
It was called Dilwail Dulhania Le Jayeng. It's apparently a classic. I've heard about that. It's on my list now. Do you watch them with subtitles? Same here. I'm trying to pick up a few Hindi phrases too. Definitely. By the way, did you notice how long Indian movies are? True. There's a nice break in the middle, too, which is interesting. Exactly. Speaking of which, have you tried any Indian food recently? I love biryani. I tried making samosas at home. Turned out pretty good. Me too. There's so much variety. Anyway, have you been to any Indian festivals? It does. I want to participate in Diwali too. The festival of lights must be beautiful. Yes, it gives a glimpse into the culture and traditions. I agree. The saris and kurtas have such intricate designs. Nice. I've been thinking of getting one too. It seems perfect for the summer. Yes, I want to watch Bahubali. I've heard it's an epic. Can't wait. Maybe we can watch it together? Great idea. I'll bring the samosas this time. Perfect. I'm looking forward to it. Well, I've got to go now, but let's chat soon about the plans. You too, Amelia. Now, let's switch the role. You go first. Hi, Ryan. Yes, I've seen a few. They're quite different from what I'm used to, but really interesting. How about you? Right? The songs are so catchy. I find myself humming them sometimes. Absolutely. It's like a celebration in every scene. Did you have a favorite part? That's what I like about Indian cinema. They blend genres so well. What movie did you watch? Oh, that's a great one. A true love story. I watched Three Idiots. It was inspiring and funny. Yes, I do. It helps understand the nuances of the dialogue. That's a good idea. It makes the experience more immersive.
Yes, they do tend to be quite lengthy, but I think it allows for more detailed storytelling. The intermission. It's a good time to discuss the movie if you're watching with others. Yes, I had some delicious biryani the other day. It complemented the movie experience. That sounds fun. Cooking Indian food is an art. I'm still learning. Not yet, but I'd love to experience Holi. The Festival of Colors looks so joyous. Agreed. It's fascinating how these festivals are depicted in movies as well. Absolutely. Speaking of culture, I've been reading about traditional Indian clothing. It's so elegant. I even bought a kurta recently. It's very comfortable. Definitely. Hey, are you planning to watch any more Indian movies soon? It is. The visuals are stunning. You'll love it. That would be fun. Let's plan a movie night. And I'll try making chai. It's a deal. Sure thing. I'll text you. Take care, Ryan. Bye.